This video demonstrates using custom properties to create role-based management groups. With this procedure, you can configure a management group so that App Manager automatically updates the group membership when it detects that an object meets or no longer meets the membership requirements. For example, if you want a management group that's made up of servers in a specific location, you can use custom properties to ensure that App Manager automatically updates the group when you add servers to or remove them from that location. In this example, we'll create a rule-based management group that's made up of servers in the Houston office. First, in the Servers view, select the objects that you want to have the custom property. In the Server Information pane, select the Custom Properties tab. In the Tasks pane, select to create a custom property. Type a name for the custom property. Select the type of data you'll use for the custom property value. For example, if the value will be a string of text, select String. You can view descriptions of the different types in the online help. Type a brief description of the custom property. Type the value to associate with the custom property. Later, after you create the rule-based management group, App Manager automatically adds the objects that have this value to the group. After you click OK, App Manager adds the custom property to the object. After you assign the custom property to the objects you want to be in the management group, you're ready to create the group. In the Enterprise Layout pane, click the topmost object or an existing management group and then select to create a new group. Type a name and brief description of the management group. Next, you'll add a rule that selects objects with the custom property as members of the management group. Click Members and then click Add. Click Rule. Create a new rule. Type a name and brief description of the rule. Select an appropriate template and add it to the rule. You can view descriptions of the templates in the online help. Replace the template variables with the appropriate values. Click OK to add the rule to the management group. App Manager creates the management group and adds the objects that meet the criteria for the rule to the group. Now that you've defined the custom property and configured the management group so that App Manager automatically updates its membership with objects that meet the rule criteria, the next time you add the custom property to an object, App Manager automatically adds the object to the group. This concludes the demonstration. Using custom properties in this way helps you ensure that management group membership remains current when your monitored environment changes. Thank you for watching.